Hi, recently in our automotive test lab, we conducted rated emissions measurements on a hybrid vehicle. In this video, we'll show you how we use the accelerated time domain scan feature implemented in Keysight's latest EMI receiver, PXC, to identify noise that is common in electronics of modern automobiles, such as a hybrid car. This is noise that is sometimes missed when using traditional methods such as sweeps. My name is Tetsuya Nakamura, let's get started. The two graphs you see here show the spectrums radiating from the engine compartment of a hybrid car and captured using two different methods. An antenna was situated near to the engine to collect the RF signals. With the engine turned on and the vehicle in an idle state, we took measurements. Since we were in open space, we would expect the spectrums to include external noise. The graph on the right shows the spectrum when measurements were taken using the real-time scan mode. This mode allows for the measurement of noise with no gaps at any frequency. It uses a unique technology called the Accelerated Time Domain Scan. This is important. No gaps at any frequency. All noise is captured providing full signal visibility. When we powered on the windshield wipers and performed other car functions, wideband noise was observed from time to time. Compared to an automobile with a combustion engine, we observed more noise emitted by the hybrid vehicle. The EMI receiver supports the max hold feature so you can also see the entire spectrum of impulse noise that appears. With the real-time scan mode, you can understand what has happened and when it happened. This is critically important when you're taking these types of measurements. If you monitor the spectrum when the wipers, fans, etc. are turned on, you will be able to isolate the source of noise. For example, we observed impulse noise when the intermittent wipers were first started up. We also took measurements using the traditional sweep method. This is represented by the graph on the left. You can see that it's difficult to capture instantaneous pulses. For many engineers, they determine the presence of noise by observing changes in the spectrum that appear for a moment in time. However, some noise may never appear on the spectrum. So even though noise may be present, you'll never see it. This highlights the inherent weakness of using traditional sweeps. Over time, on-vehicle electronics will continue to be more complex, and it'll be more important than ever to be able to identify noise regardless of whether it is of the wideband or narrowband type. Toyo Corporation's Emission Measurement and Analysis software EPXVE fully utilizes the Accelerated Time Domain Scan. With the software, you can check the noise level fluctuations in time domain immediately after taking measurements. Let's look at an example. As the markers move, the noise level fluctuations in time domain at a selected frequency are displayed. At the frequency band where only the peak detector responded, we see that the noise is due to intermittent impulse noise. You can also understand at what intervals and frequency noise appear making it possible for you to identify the source. At this frequency, the QP detector has also responded. Hence, you will need to look out for the noise level at this frequency in subsequent EMC measurements. When you zoom in and check the noise level fluctuations near the narrowband signal, you can see there is an element keeping the level stable in the wideband signal. The EPXVE software represents several decades of engineering development work at Toyo with several thousand deployments worldwide. It is a de facto standard for vehicle emissions test and measurement. We have shown the power of the accelerated time domain scan feature when evaluating radiated emissions from the EUT or equipment under test. In addition to providing reliable measurement results, it allows you to characterize the behavior of noise while performing QP measurement for wideband signals. The latest Keysight EMI receiver PXC with this feature is fully compliant with the SysPer standard. The solution can be used for EMC compliance testing. A large number of our customers have experienced up to 50% reduction in the amount of time spent on testing by utilizing this Toyo solution. Thanks for watching, please feel free to contact us if you have any questions and or demo requests. Test your EUT with confidence. Test with Toyo. Until next time, goodbye.